This is my Diamond Director's Skill Build Drill, the 10-2 drill. The purpose of this drill is to develop a great load. There's six parts of the swing, stance, load, approach, contact, extension, and finish. And those six parts are supported by timing and tempo. Timing is when we get loaded, tempo is how we get loaded. So in this drill, we're gonna focus on the load. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start out, we're gonna have our bat, and I wanna have my back foot lined up with the knob of the bat, and I wanna have my front foot about an inch away from the end. So for me, I swing a 33 inch bat, and my feet are now 33 inches apart from my loaded position. So starting out in my stance before I get loaded, I'm about an inch off. So with this drill, the 10-2 drill, I'm starting out, my back foot's lined up with the knob, I get my front foot in the air, and I'm gonna hold that for 10 seconds, and that's gonna require a lot of balance, a lot of strength, and a lot of coordination. So we're not developing a good load unless we're strong and we're balanced, and we're gonna be able to check that here. So we should be able to do that for 10 seconds. At this point, I'm still in my stance. So I'm here, I've got my hands up, I'm holding this position for 10 seconds, hands go back, and I take my stride, the length of the bat, and I'm gonna hold that for 10 seconds. I'm in a good loaded position right now. My hands are between my shoulder and my ear. My weight is back without me having to lean, and I'm not overcompensating for it, and this is a very strong load position. From here, especially if I do it on time and with good tempo, I have a great opportunity to track the pitches properly. So again, I'm starting out with my back foot on the knob. I'm holding it up for 10 seconds, requiring, requiring strength and balance. 10 seconds, hands back, foot forward, the full length of my back, and I'm in a loaded position. When I landed, I didn't have to lean. I'm working hard to not go forward. I'm landing on the full length of the back. My feet are even, they are closed, and this bat also too is gonna allow to make sure that my feet remain even so that way I can properly track the pitch. So this is very simple. 10 seconds, hands back, full length of the bat, my front heel is down, it's engaged in the ground. So I'm in a great loaded position. So again, the purpose of this drill is to make sure we're getting loaded properly, on time, with good tempo, so that I can track the pitch and ultimately be able to produce power when I'm extending. So we gotta really make sure that the key points is making sure that my hands are going back, my foot is landing forward, making sure that I'm the full length of my bat, my feet are aligned, and my heel is on the ground. And remember, good hitters don't work hard, good hitters work smart.